Hey, this is Digital Byte Computing, and today we're going to look at how to lock your iPhone to a particular application. So if I've got an application open and I want to lock it so that I cannot get out, even by clicking the home button or pushing on the screen or anything like that, we're going to look at how to do that right now. So from the home screen here, we want to go into the settings area of your iPhone. And then you're presented with the settings area and you go into the general tab and then down to accessibility. So within here, you've got an option down the very bottom called guided access. All right, you'll see that currently guided access is turned off. We want to go ahead and turn guided access on. Now you want to put in a passcode here. Um, you want that passcode to be something secure that only somebody that has the rights to unlock that application will know, okay? So we're gonna set that guided passcode. We're just gonna say one, 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 one. Let's make it nice and easy. Obviously you'll make it harder and you can put on touch ID if you do have that on your iPhone also. And then go back and your guided access is now on. So I can now go out of this and I can, for example, open up YouTube. Let's open up YouTube. And we're gonna go to my channel, Digital Byte Computing. And then we can just select, let's say I've got this video here. All right, it's now gonna start to play this video. Let's say you want to be able to lock this application so that all that is being seen is this video. All right, so this video we're going to turn, we're going to click the home button three times. All right, so you, you rapidly click the home button on your iPhone three times. That is now going to put that into guided access. All right, you've got some options down the bottom and you've also got start. Our options area lets you circle areas on the screen you would like to disable. All right, I can actually go ahead and say, this area here will never be able to be clicked. All right, so let's say I've got an ad here, you know, an ad for Uber. I can say here, well, this install button is now disabled by default. So as soon as I click on start, you can click anywhere on the screen, but that area will not be clickable. All right, that's a great feature there. Under the options area, you've got a few things here. Do you wanna enable or disable certain features? Should I, when I'm in guided access mode, be able to use a sleep wake button, be able to use the volume buttons, be able to do motion, use my keyboard, touch the screen, and do I want a time limit? Okay, so by default, um, you know, your keyboard and your touch will be enabled. All right, so I can say done, and I can start it, and that is now playing, that is now in guided access mode. I can scroll, I can do whatever I want, you know, I can go into another video, I can play it, but I can't use my volume buttons up and down. I can't use my turn off button. It's not actually working. And you'll see that on the top, it says guided access is enabled. Triple click the home button to exit. So it's essentially it's telling me you're trying to click a feature that is disabled by default. So I triple click the home button. I'm now going to get prompted to put in my passcode. All right. And then I'm back to my same view. So I can go back to options and I can say touch is off, keyboard is off, done, resume. And now guided access is started and I'm, you can't obviously see this, but I'm pushing on the screen and it's not doing anything. It will not let me get out. Okay, I'm actually now stuck. Unless I do a triple click, put in my pin code, and then I'm back to the original view. I can go back into my options and I can turn these features back on, I can done, and then I can just say end. All right, so now guided access enabled, and there you go, that's really all that it is. So I can now have full control over an application that I can lock. In this case, this is a video, but you may have a particular application. Let's say, for example, you're in a restaurant, you wanna have you know, an iPad that's locked to a menu, that sort of stuff or an iPhone that's locked, uh, you've got full control directly from this guided access um, thing to go and do that. 
To turn it off, you go back into settings, into the accessibility and down to guided access and you can just turn that off. And that is the guided access. It is a great feature. A lot of people don't actually know that it exists, but it is built in by default on your iPhone and that is it. So please feel, feel free to comment below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. It also helps me to grow my channel and know what your thoughts are and we'll talk to you next time. Thanks for watching. So if you found that video helpful, please like it and subscribe to my channel, Digital Byte Computing, just on the button there for more videos.